want to know what it is. Information. Remember. Information. All I'm offering is the truth, nothing more. I am not a number. I am a free man. <laughs> and a very warm welcome if you've just joined me on my channel, Nigel's View on Things. How you doing? How you keeping? Hope everybody's safe and sound where you are. Today we're going to be looking at the Northern Lights and you can go to the Canadian Space Agency. I'll leave the links in the description box down below so it's easy for everybody to find and you can actually watch the videos of what we're going to see and you can go back and have a look yourself. Northern Lights, what are the Northern Lights? Well, auroras are natural displays of light that can be seen with the naked eye. Auroras occur when charged particles, electrons and protons collide with the gases in the Earth's upper atmosphere, producing tiny flashes that fill the sky with colourful light. As billions of these tiny flashes occur in sequence, the light appears to move or dance. In the Northern Hemisphere, the lights are named Aurora Borealis or Northern Lights, while in the Southern Hemisphere they are called Aurora Australis or Southern Lights. And there's many, many different links that you can have a look at as you go through the page up the top and down below. You can also view the videos live, standard, low definition, high definition, or you can go and have a look at the past videos that are archived. If we go down the page here, we can see that you can view the latest video just here, or you can click through and they tell you everything you need to know about the information about the Northern Lights and the Aurora Borealis or whatever you like to call them. Right, let's have a look at a video clip. I'm going to start it from 29 minutes past midnight because before that point nothing really happened. And we're going to be looking at the 13th of November 2017. What I've done, I've increased the brightness and that's all I've done. I've used no filters and the reason I've done that is to brighten the picture up just that little bit so we can see a little bit better because otherwise it will be a little bit dark. And what we're just about to see in the clip, I've never seen before. It doesn't mean it's never happened, but I'm just saying it's very, very strange whether it be right or wrong. And the first thing we can notice, they're using a fish-eyed lens which gives us a complete 360 degrees of the sky and there's a bit of ice on the lens there but it doesn't subtract from what we're watching but the power of these auroras is quite amazing and you're just about to see it here we can see that the uh, line just flashed there and the power lines just about to flash there as these auroras come through the sky we've got a red flash going on here is this a transformer going off not rightly too sure but uh, this is truly amazing and how wonderful our whole entire earth is how beautiful and look at that dance through the sky what a wonderful sight i think you can totally totally agree with that 100 percent but now the sky starts to change it's not dancing it's sort of like well yeah you can make your own minds up And if we look over here, we get our moon starts to rise. And as our moon starts to rise, something quite strange happens. Down here, we get a pulsing of the sky. It looks like a big plasma screen TV going absolutely nuts. And like I said, I've never seen this effect before. It seems to be going this direction. Is there something behind the moon or in that sort of general direction? Many people are showing some very, very strange things about the moon at the moment. And yeah, it looks like it's arcing through the sky. I think you can say this is quite strange. It seems to be going in this direction as our moon is coming this direction. What a strange effect we're getting. No longer are we getting dancing plasma filaments auroras or whatever you like to call them we're getting a arcing of the sky for me this is quite strange it's for you to make your own minds up what i'm trying to say should our sky look like a big electrical box that's shorting out or should we have rolling auroras for me it's quite strange it looks like there's an interaction between our atmosphere and something incoming 
and that's what I believe. Mother Nature is screaming and shouting at us and telling us many different things. Earthquakes, volcanoes, weather. Are we listening? Most of us are not paying attention, but it's for you to make your own minds up. Juliana from Identify This, she hasn't been very well at all. She's been in hospital and she asked if I could pass a message on that she's pre-recorded to yourselves and her subscribers. I really do hope you get well soon, Juliana. Let's listen to the message. Hello, everyone. This is Identify This and Nigel is helping me get this message to you. Thank you so much, Nigel. And I just wanted to let you all know that the reason why I have not been posting for quite a few days now, it's because I have been actually really sick and had to go to the hospital for a couple of days. Um, I am home now, but not quite there yet. But just so you all know, I will be posting very, very soon. Thank you so much for understanding. Please go over, subscribe, share the love she could do with your support. I'll leave the links in the description box down below so it's nice and easy for everybody to find. Get well soon, Juliana. That's all I've got for you now. Much love, much peace, and I'll catch you next time. Take care.